This was the coolest thing ever in 2014. No. So, this is Super Smash Brothers for 3DS, and I kind of wanted to just peruse uh, the, the, the vault, if you will, because, uh, you know, I, I feel like most people kind of remember mostly Wii U stuff when it comes to Smash Brothers for 3DS and Wii U. And, uh, you know, I just kind of want to reminisce, because, like, I also, like, mainly remember Smash Wii U, but um, Smash, Smash 3DS is, like, the coolest thing ever. You will need the latest update in order to use save data. Okay. Okay. I'll update. So I think that's the only way that I can actually, like, launch this thing with save data. But either way, um, back in 2014... Son of a bitch. Oh my god! And 30 minutes later, we are officially here. Let's see if this even works. Alright, so uh, Super Smash Bros. for 3DS uh, released in 2014 and was probably, like, at least in the top three highlights of that year for me um, in terms of Nintendo games and in real life. But it was such an amazing feeling to finally have Smash Brothers on a handheld. Uh, and to me, I, I personally kind of prefer this version to Smash Brothers for Wii U. Actually, data will be created. Um, I, I prefer this version to Smash Brothers for Wii U simply because um, I kind of see it as, like, there there was more interesting stuff um, in this version comparative to Smash Wii U, because Smash Wii U just kind of felt like it was by the numbers. Like, you know, you look at the stage selection, you look at the trophy selection, all that stuff, and it just wasn't nearly as as interesting. You can now enter... Okay, let me... Let me, let me see this one second. Oh, thank God. Okay, I was worried since that to update that, uh, that, um, my, uh... My my save data wouldn't be here, but I believe I believe it's all here, except it's a little odd because um, it doesn't show like the new. Let me let me see if like it has unlockable characters here. I don't think it does. No, it does. There it is. There they are. Um, it just doesn't have the DLC downloaded, I guess. Let me see. Smash solo. Uh, yeah, no DLC, but, uh, it has the unlockables, which is fun. Um, but yeah, just, just to give, like, some background. So, Smash 3DS was so damn cool just to be able to play this on the 3DS, of course. Is it the optimal way to play Smash Brothers? Of course not. It, of course it isn't. But it was still really damn cool. It, it ran incredibly well on the system. It looked really good. It sounded really good. It, it was Smash Brothers on the go, and the fact that they got Smash 4 working on the 3DS and well, like, it's just like, it, it was amazing. And, and I, I just feel like them focusing more so on handheld-oriented stuff with the trophies and the stages and all of that, not only that, but Smash Run was a super cool mode. You know, it had its flaws, but it was a really fun little uh, little addition. I feel like Smash 3DS was more fun. Like, I, I look back at it more fondly because it was a cooler, fresher experience. It was something that... Um, hadn't been done before. In Smash Wii U, um, especially after, you know, I, I checked out Brawl, and I looked through the trophies of Brawl, and I realized just how many of those trophies were just kind of ported over to Smash Wii U, and a lot of Brawl stages were just ported over to Smash Wii U, and a lot of Smash 3DS stages are Brawl stages and Melee stages, but I feel like the difference is, I, I can forgive that with this being a handheld game. With Smash Wii U being the big bad console game, um, I can't really, I, I don't know, I can't really forgive that as much. Um, but, what I'm really here for is the vault. Um, I just really want to look at the trophies because I haven't in so long. Now let me see if they're still here. Because I was really worried about that, yep. I mean, most of them are all here. Um, 682, which is quite a lot. Uh, let me see. So, yeah, I think the main problem here is that um, they do not show the games these trophies came from, which is 
a bit of a problem considering that some of these like are very obscure and I think that's a bit of an issue. But for the 3DS, these are good these are good ass looking trophies. Look at that. Tom Nook, Gooey Bum, Winter Isabel. Funny hood, a lot of them are are kind of uh also in um they're also in Smash Wii U. Shadow, Franklin, the Yellow Devil. But these look really good for 3DS. Like they don't really look that compromised. Whoops. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. There, I'm back. Me Force Captain? Leave that yeah, that's a street pass thing. I was never um I didn't get into the street pass games at all, really. It's unfortunate. TV game fifteen. That was in the Wii U one. Party ball. Boo, Wii U. It's a fire emblem. That is a fire emblem, alright. Screw attack. Steel Diver. Yeah, I remember all these from Wii U. Reaper General from F from Find Me. Arlon the Serene. Pitfall. Like Mega Volnut. Interesting to see like uh, a couple of these. Which were Wii U. Like, this was Wii U as well. <laughs> these were not in Smash Wii U from what I remember. That was Adult Link from Ocarina of Time. That is interesting that that, I believe this was a 3DS exclusive trophy. And they just made it a 3DS exclusive trophy because of Ocarina of Time 3D. Which I think is a bit, bit, a bit of a cheap, uh, <laughs> a cheap one there. Yeah, oh yeah, 3DS focuses on handheld trophies. Here's Ocarina of Time 3D. A handheld version of a console game. Specknose, Bugsy, Sandbag. Donkey Kong All Chic Toon Link, Samus Zelda Link. Yeah. So the main thing with um, 3DS was that they uh, they had a lot of these alternate character trophies, and I believe you got these for All Star Mode. In the Wii U version, you'd get uh, Final Smash trophies for All Star Mode, which were way cooler. Um, and you just got these for All Star Mode, but you still had the alternate costume uh, trophies in Smash Wii U. But uh, this time it was like um, they were uh, they were just like things you could buy in the shop, I believe. Katanana, Ganondorf, Me Gunner. Yeah, I already did look at the Wii U one, so a lot of these are a bit of a like a. I've already seen them. You know, this is probably why the Wii U Super Scope trophy was so blurry. Because it was made for 3DS. Because this looks clear as uh, clear as Christ. That's a good ass looking trophy. Some of these trophies look better on 3DS. Because <laughs> that Super Scope trophy on the Wii U version was super blurry. Like the logo that said Super Scope 6. That was super blurry. I hate this trophy. I hate this trophy so much. It's so dumb. Motion Sensor Bomb. Dancer. Deku Nuts. This... This is the same as the Wii U trophy, which is pretty much the same as the Brawl trophy of Deku Nuts. Doc Lewis. His face is still a little, like, uh, a little too realistic in this one. I don't know, his eyes are just so weird. Uh, some Ness. General Pepper. Master Ball. Spirit Train, look at that. That's a, that's a fun trophy for 3DS. Damn it. <laughs> I keep messing that up. Ledger. Assist trophy. Tokabi. I just want to go through all these dumb alternate trophies. Uh, classic mode. Uh, gold from classic mode. They have to. Uh, yeah, that's a bit of a lame trophy. Whatever. Wentworth! Amazing. Golden hammer. Custom part. Give me, Give me some goods. I always love how the soccer ball is always a Mario themed trophy. Like it, it always says it's from the Mario franchise. I want to see some wacky tro. Oh god, they do these dumb 2D only trophies. This is an F Zero. This is an F Zero vehicle. It would have been cool if it was 3D though. Like it's it's a cute little like ha ha moment to see them in 2D, but still. Me Sword Fighter, me Gunner. 
Damn it! <laughs> Sheriff, not gross. Tempo from Harmonite. I like this game. I probably wouldn't care for it right now because it's a very simple rhythm platformer game, but um, back in the day on the 3DS eShop, it was, it was really cool. Power. Dr. Wright. Zelda Spirit. And they have to clarify, it's from Spirit Tracks. I keep messing that up. Eggplant Pit. Lipstick. Hades. One. SBO. The Me Apartments from Tomodachi Life. I love Tomodachi Life, and I will gladly take this a trophy. I keep messing up. Energy Tank. I, I do like how it's cell shaded. Statue Mario from 3D Land. Some good stuff. It's really weird you got this after beating the, the main game. Like, this was a post-game power-up, which I found weird. Like... Why even bring back the Tanuki suit if this is going to be, like, the special version of the power-up? Like, you know, it, 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 it's a lot. Cream and cheese, egg robo, zipper tea bunny. Yeah, a lot of these are just kind of the same. Okay, Bakura from Xevious. See, this is really weird. Okay, so, like, these are obviously, you know, 3D, but most of the other Namco trophies are 2D sprites only. So it's it's weird that this one they decided to make like a 3D 3D thing. Rusty. So Rusty's real deal baseball on the 3DS is a uh, is an interesting one. It's a um the uh the entire gimmick is that it's free to free to play. It's free to start. Um but you have to you still have to pay for the mini games inside. Like Rusty is like a dealer, like he deals you baseball mini games. But you can haggle with him and you can try to break you can try to you can try and get him to as low of a price as possible to pay, and you pay real life money. And the games are actually kind of fun; like they're fun little mini games. Um, and it's it's a cute it's a cute idea. I I thought. Golagon. I'm not even gonna attempt to understand, like, or try to act like I know what that is. Engineer Link, there he is. Oh, look at him; he's so happy. Eevee, Pow Block, Charmy B, the Jack Russell Terrier from Nintendogs. I never played Nintendogs plus Cats for 3DS. I, I wanted to, but I think the I kind of I kind of passed the time when I, I really should have, and now I'm kind of like there's 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 not much point. Uh, Malo from Pushmo. I, I do I did very much love the original Pushmo, but I never got into. Uh, Oh man, what's the, uh, I'm trying to think of the second one. I know th the third one, I believe, is Stretchmo. I'm trying to think, what was, what was the second one? Oh my god. I have to look this up. I'm, I, was the second one Stretchmo? I gotta, I gotta see. Pushmo, and let me see. Because this is gonna drive me insane. Crash Mo, that's what it was. Okay, Crash Mo, and then there's Stretch Mo. I only play Push Mo, but I love Push Mo. Espresso from Donkey Kong Country. Tortimer. Paper Gooper Blooper. I do like, uh. I mean, this is. This is a bit of a Sticker Star-esque character, as in it was from Sticker Star, but uh, man, Sticker Star had some good, good <laughs> art design. I think it, I think it looked really good. Obviously, the character design was garbage because there wasn't any, but um, I really liked how the characters looked. I think that that looks super, super fun and cool. Um, and I like the the shininess and all that. And I will say, like in terms of like the overall like renders like in terms of what i like the most i loved the box art design for like paper mario and paper mario sticker star i love how he looks and i love how all the characters look because they they legitimately do very much look like paper while color splash and uh origami king they they don't look as papery in my opinion i i think like sticker star actually looks like they they took cardboard cutouts 
or uh, construction paper cutouts, and they made uh, they made the box art out of that, which I thought was really cool. A calico cat. Impa. Maya. Uh, oh, is this from um, Spirit Camera? See, this is what I'm talking about. I really, I like, <laughs> I like weird, obscure picks like that for um, trophies. Skyrunner from a. Uh, from the Mother series. Chandelure. Gulliver! Bonus fruit. Professor E. Gad. And then we have the Game & Watch trophies, which they have a lot of these. Give me, give me some fun ones. I want fun ones. Mugly. Nintendoji. Nintendoji is the name of a game that was given out to 2012 Golden Platinum Club Nintendo members in Japan. In the game, Nintendoji is also the name of the young man who is trying to save a co uh, country on the brink of destruction. I recognize this character from Smash Ultimate Spirits. So that solves a mystery for me. <laughs> I've heard of this name and I was just like, oh, well, there we go. I have my answer. That's where that came from. King Babam, Dunban, Super Leaf Souffle, another Game and Watch, <laughs> the Pac Man All. I do like this trophy. Star Force Mega Man. They reused this trophy like since Brawl. <laughs> Luigi with the Poltergust 3000. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about when it comes to uh, Namco trophies. Like, they just do these 2D ones. Paper Wiggler. Like, come on, that's... At least as a trophy, that's neat. <laughs> I know I just bitched about flat trophies, but at least this has a reason to be flat with it being Paper Mario. Like, come on, that just looks kind of fun. Spike Top, Funky Kong. Demon Train. They had a lot of, uh, they've, they've had a lot of Spirit Tracks trophies. I mean, there is a Spirit Tracks stage, so it makes sense, but... Tanuki Mario and Kitsune Luigi. That's, uh, I, I like that. I, I like that. My old gunman. Iggy! Oh, I, I remember this one. <laughs> I like when they're just so abnormally large for trophies. <laughs> but that is the Mute City track. These are the same trophies that were in Brawl. Devil and Andros. Rainbow Road! Alright, look at that. How would this even work as a legitimate trophy in real life? <laughs> it's still cool. Like, this is like, this is like one of the trophies you're like, oh, yeah, when you get Smash Ball. Advanced Wars Tanks. Paper Bowser. Look at that. You get the little sticker, the shiny sticker effect, which is fun. Chibi Robo and Chibi Tot. There they are. Look, it's my guys. Chibi Robo from the not-too-distant future travels back in time to collect nostalgia junk. Uh, so this is blatantly referencing Chibi Rebel Photo Finder. Beehive, Nat, Armor Train, Smart Bomb. That is a full-on... That is referencing to the most stock art of Wario you can find online. <laughs> Alfonso! Three Sacred Treasures. I like how in every single game, Pit has a different Final Smash. The Chorus Kids, there they are! That was a big deal when, um, they were basically deconfirmed. Because <laughs> I think, uh, people found, because Smash 3DS, uh, leaked early. And, um, and, uh, people were, like, just feverishly live-streaming it, trying to find as much as possible. And, um, and Chorus Kids were heavily rumored to be unlockable characters in the game, and they're just a trophy. There's Takamaru. 
Turn two blue. I don't know if that was in the Wii U one. It might have been. I'm not sure. Might have been a 3DS exclusive just because like these the 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 um ghosts actually turn to blue in the uh, Pac Maze stage. Which uh there aren't any ghosts that turn to blue in Smash Wii U. And Oh, the Tomodachi Life Golden Apartment. I want a new Tomodachi Life game. I like this game. It's really dumb, but I like it. <laughs> Damn it. Leila. Blanca. Mike Bell P Switch. They had a lot of these uh, yoga poses. Dungeon Man. Yoshi's New Island. That's just the entire. <laughs> That's just the whole name of the trophy. This is one of the most disgusting trophies I've ever seen in my life. What is this? <laughs> so is this just a straight up rip from the Yoshi's New Island game? Because like, this this is an oddly low polygon model. I assume it's from the actual game considering it looks like that. Because like, I, I don't know. It's like, a, you know, since it's a 2D game and it's from a certain angle, they probably, you know, could have cut corners a little bit there. That's odd. New Island is fine, I guess, but it's just, it, it's not, <laughs> it's not great. Not my thing, personally. Mewtwo. Oh, damn, that's a good, that's an awesome trophy. Look at that. That looks awesome. My God. Puka from Dig Dug. Why did they get the cool Namco trophies in the 3DS one? This one was actually 3D. Come on. Okay, Hunter. The Piranha Plant, which is the exact same trophy model as uh, the exact same model as the uh, the official render in uh, in Smash Ultimate. Oh, how does Rock Pikmin look on the 3DS? Because like this was a really high quality model on Wii U. They at least still have like the little reflection and stuff off of the rock, but uh, it was it was a lot more detailed on Wii U. There's beat. I hate this trophy. There's adult Zelda heart container X bone. Doctor Kawashima, the one and only Albert. I do like the big the big boy trophies. Squirtle, snow people. Ah, <laughs> uh. twin bellows. Clyde, thank thank Christ for Clyde. Generator. It's always interesting which trophies they decide to make, like rotatable. Which ones like they just refuse. Eddie. Water himself from Fluidity Spin Cycle. I wish he was a character. Man, like I gotta be honest, like uh if you uh if you played either Smash 3DS or Wii U, I feel like the amount of trophies between the two are a little too similar. <laughs> to the point that I'm like, why not just make them both the same? <laughs> because like they're so similar already. Like you might as well just keep them the same. At least that one's fun. Nintendo Pocket Football Club trophy. And look at that. That's a sprite. That's a sprite trophy I can get behind. I like the little shadows. Like a two on Cloud Nine. They have the uh, Pokemon Trainer from Pokemon X and Y. I believe that was definitely not in the Wii U one. Mega Man EXE. Chariot Master. Donkey Kong in the Barrel Train. From Mario Kart 7. They had a bunch of Mario Kart Wii trophies in Smash Wii U. And then they obviously had a lot of Mario Kart 7 ones here. Blooper. I find it odd that they don't list anything. Like for where the games came from. You know? Just feel like that, that just leads to a lot of confusion and... And it's something that, like, really, like, you couldn't have done that on the 3DS? Like, you obviously could have. Daisy. Tennis outfit Daisy, that is. 
they most I, I've I've noticed a lot in Smash Brothers games. They uh they tend to not usually have a Daisy trophy <laughs> at least in Brawl and Wii U, and instead they usually opt for uh oh Daisy from from Mario Strikers, Daisy from Mario Tennis. There's a link from Spirit Tracks again. They have a ton of Spirit Tracks content here. It's crazy. Pac Maze. Okay, I kind of like that trophy, but still, it's a little lame. <laughs> It's like really how much did this how 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 difficult was this for him? That's a PNG, come on. <laughs> uh That's just my thing. I, I I just feel like a lot of these trophies could be a lot cooler if they were um full 3D models. There's Steel Diver. Just a full on Steel Diver trophy, that's cool. I'm not a big Steel Diver guy, but I like it being represented. Irish Arch Archwell. Sneaky Spirits from Rhythm Heaven. Oh, they do have a lack do. Oh, that's like a that's a weird like Mario sixty four style lack of too. Wonder what this is specifically from because this looks very N sixty four esque, but a little more high quality. It's interesting. Paper Peach. Mario with the gold light. That's a good trophy. I like that. It's from New Super Mario Brothers 2. Another game and watch. You have to. Oh, I like I like this one. Again, Sticker Star. Not a great game, but I like the little uh I, I, I like I like what they did with like the art style, like with this kind of stuff, you know. I think it looks fun. Looks very interesting. Other than that, it's not a good game, but still. <laughs> I was, weirdly enough, I was hoping this was an actual bridge and instead it was a yoga pose. There's Rob. Paper Luigi. Just straight up Paper Mario. It's interesting how, like, the entire description is so based on sticker star like that's all they really reference there's king k rule there he is knuckles golden retriever hell yeah god that's lame who wanted that trophy and i lost it already that's lame, but Tortimer Island, that's cool. Mario with the propeller box from Mario 3D Land. That was always kind of an eh, eh, eh a little power up, you know, nothing, nothing great. The ghosts, okay, so Smash Wii U had the ghosts from Luigi's Mansion 1. So of course they have the garbage looking ghosts from Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, or Luigi's Mansion 2. And the 3DS one. These aren't great, but eh, the effect looks kind of cool here. I think they look nice, but the you know, designs are just not ideal. There's Mega Man, Starfy. Which, when he was in a brawl, they just had to call his trophy Staffy because uh, that's all they he was known as. That would, that's what he's known as in Japan. The Golden Fox. Again, come on, guys. <laughs> Not a fan of that, but it's whatever. Reset bomb. Oh, shoot. Can I zoom in? Yeah. Oh, the Ice Climbers. The poor guys. Duck Hunt. Paper Kirsty. Wow, they specifically have to say paper. It's fair, but still. Peach. Tennis pal for the Peach. Where's Barbara the Bat? Also, why is this trophy just Mario Golf World Tour? <laughs> when the other trophies are like, oh, it's Peach, but Golf Outfit Peach, or, or uh, Tennis Outfit Peach. Why is this just Mario Golf World Tour? This just be Mario Golf. <laughs> okay. Where's Barbara the Bat? I remember Barb. There she is, Barbara the Bat. From Jam the Band or whatever it is. Karate Joe, there he is. Fun stuff. 
Dixie Kong. At least the alt trophies are different between each version, but that doesn't mean I, I, I like the alt trophies that much. They're not super interesting to me. Boomerang Mario. Tingle. There's the Phantom. Again, like, they have... You know, on second thought, so, like, I, I do like the 3D. Yeah, you know, obviously, like, they have a lot They have a lot of cool random trophies, but uh, on second thought, I'm looking at it, and, like, a after looking at the Wii U version, I, I feel like a lot of trophies are shared between the two to the point that, like, it it's, it's not as interesting <laughs> to look through this one now. Uh, but you have the fossil fighters, which is which is cool, which is which is definitely better than all the Wii U trophies combined. Yeah, at least you have Prism Tower, and I'm not. I don't think this is all of the trophies. I'm probably missing like at least a few of them, especially when it comes to like the DLC because like the DLC isn't installed on this one. That's all of them, and um, I like them, but um. I think I think the main thing is like comparative. You know, I just looked at the Wii U ones, so this one was um, not nearly as interesting to go through because a lot of those trophies are more so like uh, you know they're just uh, they're, they're they're just the same <laughs> across both versions, and uh, and there's so many alternate trophies and, and those damn F Zero trophies that are literally just they're, they're literally just two D sprites. Um, you know, obviously looking back. I think the Wii U one had a, had a bit more cool things in there, but I will definitely prefer, I definitely prefer Brawl's, Brawl selection of trophies, because, like, they had so much weird garbage in that game that I love so much more. This one felt a little too, like, there were so many Spirit Tracks trophies, and that's fine, but it's like, uh, you know, it just, it just felt odd. Um, I, I think it would have been cool to see, like, Link's Awakening or the Oracle games from Zelda to get represented if they wanted to do handheld stuff. Um, or other handheld entries, you know, Metroid 2 stuff, um, you know, more, more stuff from, like, the original, the original Kirby game, Kirby's Dream Land, Dream Land 2, um, or, like, random spinoffs, like Kirby's Pinball Land or something, or Kirby Star Stacker, um, you know, just, just stuff like that, um, but let's see the Horde. Yup, that's a Horde, all right. I don't actually know how many trophies are in Smash 3DS, but I believe I'm pretty damn close to getting them all. It's the shop. I mean, I always... I like the shop. Is there anything I don't own? I believe I own all... Of, yes, I own all of these, but I'll, I'll buy... No, no, no. That's 2500 Of course not. I'll buy Slippy. There he is. And... Well... Gotta be honest. I am incredibly disappointed and my year is ruined.